going to see multiple level threes here. Is he gonna is he gonna bless us with it? I think I think he's gonna find a way. I'm expecting at least one level three raw level three in this set. Mm -hmm. Where I think off of a vanish, uh, they're gonna hit a button, and I think Chris G's gonna level three them. Chris G is a very, very strong player. He's mm -hmm. had some up and downs in his performances, mm -hmm. but it really seems like he wants to come back in a big way, and I think Summer Jam is a great start to that. This is definitely his chance to do so. Um we I So Trunks, as we were saying before, super fast, yes. super mobile, one of the fastest, best um, movement options inside of the game as far as really anybody in the roster is concerned. I feel like he's really only rivaled by uh, Zamasu and his ability to move across the street. Yeah. Uh, but I was curious if we're going to see, oh. Oh, Trunks is wow. not coming out to There's play no trunks. here. What on earth? Well, he has been, uh, Chris G has been rocking Tien for a while here now mm -hmm. as a substitute character. Um, a lot of players opted to drop Trunks mainly because his lack of a 2L made it very difficult to open characters up. Mm -hmm. And so we are going to see, oh, what music are we going to be rocking here? Oh, Vachita. Of course. Of course. Right. <laughs> Rudimentary, my dear Watson. Chris G is going to go ahead and start this match with Gohan, Team Gohan, of course, Tien. Super Saiyan Vegeta, whereas we're also going to see base Vegeta, Super Saiyan Goku, and Cell on the enemy side. Yes, we are. Uh, really interesting is actually uh, Goichi's recent tier list that he put out. He had Gohan in A tier. Hmm. Goichi believes there's some serious things hiding with this character. We're going to see what he can put on here. Nice start here. Immediately goes in. Get in and connect the well and going straight. Long in this combo. Knockdown through the house, comes out. All right, and here we go. That's going to be a whiff reflect, and Static Gorilla is going to dash back in here. Nice pickup, and here we go. He is dropping him in the corner, throws the Destructo disc, and there we go. Nice assist. Great punish on that assist there by Static Gorilla. But Chris G is going to go ahead and take point, putting Static Gorilla back up in the air. He has the ability here to go. Oh. Resets immediately Ooh. on the overhead. Kind of nice, kind of nice, kind of clean. Nice instant air dash, and that is going to be it here for base Vegeta. Chris going to be meter efficient. Ops a DHC in. Double here once that team Gohan back on point. Really great option there. It's hard to get Gohan in sometimes. Yes, it is. And Gohan has gotten a lot better after the patch. Bomb loops and whatnot, much improved. All right, here we go. A little bit of footsies back and forth. Both players looking for a way in. Chris G, nice block string, catches him with an instant air dash overhead. Really nice conversion there. Elongates the combo with the Vegeta assist, crosses up in the middle of it, gets him on the right side, <gasps> and goes ahead and finishes with a family gun. Father, yeah. give me yeah. the strength. <laughs> Oh, I was expecting a Dragon Rush there. Nice little respect. Pushes him back into the corner. Ooh, clash immediately. And Static Gorilla wins that, pushing him up against into the same corner he was in before. Because she's on the ropes. And this is going to be it here for Team Gohan. As he DHE. No, it's not. It's going to be just short. A little bit greedy with that meter. And it is going to be a tough situation. He needs to get this last hit on Team Gohan before he tags out here. He's really looking for an opportunity to go ahead. Yep. Going to go ahead and see. That was pretty. That was great. Oh, but that Vanish is still going to connect with Team Gohan and pick him off with that pixel of health. I like that. Ooh, Clash and actually Cell wins it in the air. Going to go ahead and try to fish for something, anything. Instant overhead to convert. Gets the overhead but isn't able to get anything off of it. All right, Static was knocking at the door, but Chris G did not let him in. Here we go, setting up. Chaozu goes low, and he is bop, bop, bop. We are going to the skies right now. All right, Chris G. Drop him. What's going to be the mix? It's Chaozu! <laughs> Flashy. That unscaled Kool-Aid is gross. <laughs> Finishing it off really, really nicely there with Tien. Chris G is willing to sacrifice anything to win this match, even beloved Chaozu. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Oh. Punishes that Dragon Rush. He does only have two meters here, but it may be enough to spin it. I don't know. Uh, Not quite. Gonna Are drop. We sparking come out? Yep. All right, he's going to DHC out here. Going to bring in Vegeta. All right, and what is he going to do here? He gets a touch. Static Gorilla might want to consider sparking. It's going to get picked up. Chris G knew it was coming. Nice little extension. Drop him down. Here we go, Tien. This is not going to be enough damage. All right, not able to set up Oki. 
Gonna have to take a little bit of footsies here, but Static Gorilla is sparking, is ticking down. He's got to make a play here. Ooh, he felt that conversion with the key. And is immediately just waiting to get the sparking meter down and off. We're in the final couple of seconds of sparking. And Static Gorilla is going to go ahead and take suit. Quite a bit of damage coming down on Super Saiyan Vegeta. But no Super to finish it off. Sparking's now completely gone. Punishes the Reflect. And Chris is going to go ahead 1-0 over Static Gorilla right here. Yeah, that was a really strong performance for Chris G. He's having a good time out here. He's Man. like, what? He's, <laughs> he, he just said, I messed up. <laughs> Classic Chris right there. I, I'm, I know I won, but that was a mistake. I'm sorry. It's all right. All right. Now, I may be mistaken here, but I feel like I recognize that at Vegeta. I've seen that shirt before. I believe it's only Evo obtainable. Really? Yes. Limited edition wear out here. Yeah. Represent. Oh. I love it so much. All right, and here we go. The dash in is coming in. A little bit of footsies once again. It looks like Static Gorilla is being a little bit more careful this game, but he is going to get picked up anyway. All right, jump out of the corner, but Chris G says, hold on, let me get this. Bop, bop, bop. Drops him. He's got the meter. Nops not to spend it. Ooh. Oh. Wasn't able to buffer enough the reflect to go ahead and get the rest of that. Very <laughs> nice. Leg loops. Drops him. What's the mix? Oh, back yeah. in it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Stop. And this is why we love Team Gohan. Of course, as soon as I say that, Static Gorilla gets his chops, pushes himself out of the corner, and is now taking Team Gohan to school. Oh, man. Chris G just slams those assists. Both of them coming out, locking down Cell. Going to set up. Ops once again not to spend that cash. This man is saving it for a rainy day. I almost feel like he doesn't feel the need to. He's been saving his DHs a lot. Ooh, great conversion there. Low. Gonna go back into the leg loops. Great amount of damage here. Pops him out of the corner. We're gonna see it. Family straight into the end. <laughs> exactly what I was saying. Saving yep. up all that meter to go ahead and get the death that he needed. As you can see, he used complete amount of six and a half meters there. Actually got up to seven at the end of that combo, but he's now currently in a position. Absolutely brilliant. That was a ton of damage here. And right now, Static Gorilla down a character. Was not expecting to lose someone like that. Defensive Vegeta assist is going to allow for a pickup here. Tien's going to take it, knock him down in the corner. Only one bar. Going to probably just opt to dash in. Oh, man, Chaozu. Lock him down. Ooh, meets that vantage with another vantage of his own. Chris is doing a great job of always having meter to meet these vanishes with an option. Beautiful. Yes, he is. Ooh, punish that like crazy. <laughs> don't Full you noob, don't drop on me, sir. I know, and there we go. We also got the nice little Team Gohan extension. He's throwing it out. Oh, my God. This man believes. Was Chris G ready? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Chris G yeah. was not ready, but he was ready for that. Yeah, he ain't playing anymore. He said, okay, okay, look, look. That hurt me. That hurt my pride, sir. <laughs> I, I do respect Static Gorilla for that, because sometimes you just got to do it to him. There, there's, just, there's just no other way. There's no rhyme or reason. You just got to. Oh. Right. Ooh. Missed reflect. I guess he thought he was going to put some more pressure on. Static Gorilla is super defensive. Ooh, H yeah. connects. Oh, this is a tough situation. Static does need to spark there, because one touch was going to be death. This is a tough spot. He really needs to find some way to get his offense going. But Chris G is playing defensive, letting Sparking run down, and Static Gorilla is going to make a mistake and get picked up by Team Gohan. It's worth noting that if he is able to get enough damage on Teen right here, a DHC into Tien will go ahead and freeze that meter and kill him. Yes, it will. Is he going to get to that point, though? It looks like he's going to be gonna try just for it. short. Oh, he's going to go for he's gonna it. He's going to 100% go for it. Oh, yeah, we're going to see it. He's going to spend that last bit of meter. And it killed, of course. Wow. Optimal Chris G takes it 2-0 right now against Static Gorilla, moving up further inside of the pool brackets.